Begin by unlocking the tabs on both sides of the pump. Remove the intake screen. If you own a TT9000, after removing the intake screen, you will need to unscrew five screws with a Phillips head screwdriver from the back of the pump to remove the volute. Rotate the volute a quarter turn counterclockwise and pull the volute off of the pump body. Using the two notches in the bottom of the intake screen as a wrench, turn the rotor a quarter turn counterclockwise. Remove the rotor from the pump body. Clean the metal on the rotor until it is shiny with a sponge or Scotch-Brite pad with vinegar or a calcium lime remover. Remove any debris from inside the pump where the rotor sits with a sponge or Scotch-Brite pad with vinegar or a calcium lime remover. Clean the screen on the rotor with a soft cloth until it is free of any residue. After cleaning, place the rotor back inside the pump body. Using the wrench on the intake screen, turn the rotor one quarter turn clockwise to tighten into place. Place the volute on and tighten one quarter turn clockwise. Place the intake screen back onto the front of the pump body and lock the tabs on the sides into place. You should clean your pump once or twice a year under normal water conditions. If you have hard water, you should clean your pump more frequently.